Hey everybody, welcome to my channel and today I'm going to review and show you this eight piece Maffy nail gel. So go off you the LED polish. There is the item number. Uh, so they contacted me and asked me if I would review this set and I've been actually turning down a lot of them here lately because I just want to do stuff that I want to do. Um, I have tried Maffy before and I do think that they are a really good polish, very reasonable priced, um, very attainable for most people just trying out gel or want to add to their collection a little bit. So um, I actually have two of these so yes I'm giving this set away. This set, however, I'll be swatching for you and showing you. We're going to do a little art, um, but I wanted to tell you why I have two. Um, when I got this, the base coat had leaked. You can see it's still kind of on here. Um, and it got all the sticker and stuff. Anyway, the base coat had leaked. So I emailed them that evening with a picture and said, hey, um, I don't necessarily need another set, but it's just the base coat that leaked and I have plenty of base coat, but I just wanted to let you guys know that it leaked. Um, well, before I even had time to film, in fact, it was maybe two days. I think that was on like a Wednesday. Friday, I had another set in the mail. I mean, I hadn't even heard back from the guy yet. And then on Monday, he emailed me and said, oh, I'm really sorry about that. We'll get you another one out. And I was like, Man, it's already done. I've already got it. <laughs> so that is fast. And so I questioned him. I said, was it just because, you know, you sent it to be to begin with? And he said, no, that just went to customer service. And I didn't, you know, didn't specify that I had received it for free. I just said, hey, the gel, the base coat had leaked. So they just automatically sent me out another set, which is awesome, awesome customer service. So therefore, like I said, I don't need two sets. I'm giving one of them away. I want to know, these are little bottles. They're just little six mil bottles. How many nails will one actually paint? Now I'm going to do some artwork. I want to try to do some marbling with the brush like I've seen other people do and um, just kind of, you know, looked at it. Oh, that's cool and gone on and never tried it myself with gel. So I'm going to try it. But I have these little swatch wheels that have 10 nails on them. And so I'm going to take one of these colors, uh, probably this one because I don't like it, and <laughs> I'm going to see how many coats it will put on these 10 swatch sticks. So the goal in my life is to be able to do a video, edit it, and not have to come on here and do a little uh, correction for being stupid. There are 12 nails on that swatch wheel. You guys know I hate just doing straight up swatching. I got to do something else. I mean, I don't mind to swatch it for you and show it to you and I, cause I want to swatch it and see it, but I want to do some, something cool with it. I don't want to just paint it on a stick and go, well, there you go. Not that there's anything wrong with that. Not if that's who you are. Also, I think he gave me um, a code to use for you guys to use to buy it. It was on Amazon. I think he gave me a 15 or 20% off code. So all that will be linked below and I'll put it across the screen here. Um, I would definitely recommend this seller because they were awesome. Okay, in no particular order. I'm not going to do the base coat. Here is number um, 093. Um, it's a light purple with some gold glitters and um, iridescent sparkles in it. 031. A really pretty baby blue. 065. Ooh, that is a beautiful, like, uh, what do you call it? Platinum. That's beautiful. 606. 
Um, it's a baby pink. Now there were different choices uh, in the pull down menu for this. This is 206. This one is like a kind of a metallic green. And uh, 043 is absolutely a beautiful hollow top coat. Does come with an, um, a gel base coat and a no wipe top coat. Um, on my right hand is a Sparkling Co. Autumn Leaves Red. And on my ring finger and thumb is Peace Love and Sunflowers, SB60 from Sparkle & Co. This is a secret menu, so you do need to be a member of the Facebook group to use the secret menu. All right, so that's one coat. Oh, heck, that one is a thermal. <laughs> uh, yeah, that one is a thermal. Cool. So there it is, warm. And here it is in the cold state. Lovely. Didn't know that. The more you know. So that one is a top coat, obviously. But that one actually will build up. It would look gorgeous over that. Alright, there are they all are with two coats. Uh, so these three are definitely four. Two coats is plenty. This one builds up really well too. And that of course is just a hollow top coat. Very pretty. All right, I'm gonna zoom through this and then every time I go to cure, I'm gonna put a little mark on my paper so that we know how many times around I went and there's 10 nails, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, ooh, 12 nails on here. I can't count, evidently. And I'm gonna just paint those and uh, zoom through and let's see how many nails one bottle will paint. Um, this is a thermal too. So it is this uh, like teal blue in the cold state and a bright green in warm. So, I mean, I got a little bit here, and I didn't completely, eh, I mean, I drained it all, I just didn't scrape it out, but that's empty. So that's 60, 120, 180. 180 coats of polish is what you're going to get out of a 6 mil bottle. I never did the Polish Mountain Challenge, but I guess I just did. I'm just going to pour it out on my mat. And I'm just going to put a little strip of each. I 
don't know. I don't think I want that blue in there. Got a feeling this is going to be a mess, you guys. So I'm going to take this kind of flat, smallish brush from uh, Maniology. I've seen people use a fan brush and one of these brushes, so I'm just going to go with this one. I'm just going to pick it up. And it's dripping everywhere. And just kind of place it on my nail. And it's running. looks pretty cool. Fill in a little here and um, clean up the excess before I cure. Um, I'm going to get the white off. Let's try that again with more of the darker color on top. I like that better. And the fact that it's thermal probably isn't helping my liking it because when it warms up then that dark purple is turning pink. Alright, it looks super cool in the cold state. I really like it. And let's just put a little bit of this hollow sparkly top coat on it. Just gonna kind of dry brush it on because I don't want a lot. All right, there's the finished Manny, and I don't know, I think it looks pretty cool actually. Early. I love it. I don't like it as much when it's all warm because it just is pink. But right now, I love it. Alright you guys, don't forget to comment down below if you're United States or International. Um, and just a reminder, this is gel. You do need a light to cure it with. Or, I don't know, if you're very patient for like 12 hours worth of sunlight, you could maybe cure it in the sun. But I don't think it works that way. Bye! He's taking all of Penny's toys over to Sam. That's a good boy. I'm bringing you toys to play with Sam. No, that's not, no, no, don't. It's okay, no! Lucas?
Get away from him. Get, get away from sausage. Yeah. Him, him old man. He's so happy to see Penny. <laughs> so is Augie. Augie, no. Chill it. <laughs> no. Lucas, don't pull on her nipples. You weirdo. Lucas, no. No, oh, he's just pushing it away. <laughs> smush, smush, smush. Augie. Augie. Smush. <laughs> smush, smush. You're silly. Boogie boogie boo. Boogie boogie boo. Boogie boogie boo. Boogie boogie boo. Boogie boogie boo.